Kind of boring, huh? Well, let's do something about that. This is the Morimoto turn signal, uh, sequential turn signal replacements. I got these Morimoto housings on the retrofit source. Uh, I'll put a link in the description. Uh, they weren't they weren't cheap, but they weren't super expensive either. And I have a feeling if you were to order stock replacements, they'd probably be about the same as these. And in my opinion, these are a good bit nicer. This mod will actually do two things for me. One, it'll give me some kind of cool little uh, sequential turn signals up here. And the second thing, on the passenger side, that one got scraped a little bit by the uh, side of the garage. But, you know, even though you can barely see it, I know it's there. And now it'll be like it never happened. So, uh, let's open up the box. Inside, you're gonna have two of these there. Very similar, but one's a little more smoked than the stock one. So it'll, it'll give that cool smoked vibe, if that's what you're into. I'll show you the little quick steps to replace this, which we should just need our hands and uh, a Phillips head screwdriver. Yeah, the car's clean, but you know, gloves make you look very professional. Start by rotating it this way so you can get access to uh, this to kind of pop it off. Ooh, a little bit of dust in there. And then now we want to pop this off without breaking anything. So you just kind of use even pressure. There you go. Just like that. Now we've got two screws that hold it in. One out. It only plugs in one way, so it would be very hard to mess up. Installation is just the reverse of the removal. Snaps right, literally just snaps right in. All right, now let's see the difference. Kind of boring, huh? Ah? Uh -huh. Like I said, blinker fluid for smooth blinks. I'm pretty happy with this. Uh, as you saw, the other one was just kind of like, meh, just kind of lit up over here a little bit. Nothing necessarily wrong with it. It was functional. It, marked that the I was turning you can actually see from back here too so anyone coming up beside can see right there if they don't see your other signals so this is even a little more safe than the uh, the stock one 
Since I've had the car coated with a ceramic acrylic coating from Gary Dean, I also made sure to coat these as well so they would match and wouldn't fade prematurely. Uh, his coatings are great. None of this video is sponsored by him or his products. Uh, just mentioned that that coating should keep this from yellowing, fading, whatever plastics do in the sun for quite some time. Thanks for watching. Um, be sure to like and subscribe and all that fun stuff. Uh, this isn't really a money-making channel, so it doesn't really help me, but you know, maybe it helps my ego a bit. So like and subscribe. Uh, if you have any comments or questions, go ahead and add them in the appropriate section below. And uh, thanks for watching.